Hi there, it's Wednesday the 19th of May 2021. We're continuing to look this week about the Holy Spirit, who is the Spirit of Reconciliation. I was telling you yesterday about John and Jim, who were best friends as boys growing up all the way through their teens into their 20s, but the friendship began to, to drift apart and they weren't seeing each other nearly as much as they had done. John said something that Jim kind of took to heart and it didn't sit well with him and he didn't really know what to do or what to say about it he felt hurt he felt that their relationship was was broken was damaged and he wasn't quite sure what to do he felt a bit embarrassed to be honest about speaking to John and yesterday we're thinking about how we can feel a bit confused when our relationships or friendships maybe break down perhaps in our families or at work and we're a bit confused as to what exactly has happened sometimes. Why, why is our relationship not as good as it was with somebody with whom we had a good relationship? For Jim, he was not only confused, he was a bit embarrassed. He didn't really know what to say to John. He didn't quite know how to broach the subject or how to express what he was feeling. He felt like John had somehow let him down by what he said. And he just was a bit embarrassed, a bit ashamed of how strongly he felt, how hurt he felt. He wasn't sure whether John would really understand how hurt he was. He didn't know whether he should phone John or text him or email him or or just go and chap his door and should he invite him out for a for a coffee? Should he go for a walk? Should he just have a phone call with him? What what should he do? What should she, what should he say? Sometimes we're never too sure how to restore broken relationships, are we? Never quite sure how we can be reconciled again to the person that we have lost that relationship with. You know, the Bible says in Ephesians 4.32, it says, Be kind and compassionate to one another, forgiving each other, just as in Christ God forgave you. It's good to be able to forgive from our hearts. And when we're confused or when we're embarrassed or when we don't really know what to say and how to, how to build that bridge again, maybe thinking that, well, there's too much water going under the bridge Maybe it's been quite a while since you spoke to somebody that you've lost relationship with. But we shouldn't be embarrassed and we shouldn't be confused because the Holy Spirit within us, he's not a spirit of confusion. He's not a spirit who is embarrassed. He is able to give us the words to say. He is able to work through us and he is able to bring about reconciliation in our lives, not only with God, but with each other. May God bless you and empower you to be reconciled. Speak to you again tomorrow.